All right, we got the feeding time. He's in a dark area right now, so he's ready. But we're gonna see how hungry he is. He's been trying to eat these guys, but they're just too goddamn big. His mouth just is not big enough. Right here we got a tiger nose, or shovel nose tiger catfish. I'm gonna turn on the light. He doesn't like the light, but we're gonna see if he likes it anyways. See if he's hungry enough to eat. We got him some new fish, a little smaller. Okay, there's the light, but he does not like the light. He will turn almost. It doesn't look like he's gonna turn at all. Looks like he knows what's going on and he wants some food. These guys are just too goddamn fat, even though he's multiply tried enough times to eat them. So right now we went and got some of the same fish. Let me just bend over. It's only me here. Stay with me. There we go. We got some lovely smaller pond comets. So what we're going to do is just going to sit this down right here. Hopefully I still can watch a little bit. We're just going to dump them right on in. See what the fuck it does. One and two. Alright, so we've successfully planted this smaller pond comet. Now they're not that much smaller, but he definitely smells them. And he's going to eat him for sure. He's been hungry. He's going to go right to it. His tentacles rising. Oh, he knows. See, he's moving. Usually he's a fish that doesn't move and hits from silence. But he's probably pretty hungry. Not that hungry. He ate my last fish, the bugger. He's been in there for a whole entire year, and then he ate him. For no apparent reason. I watched it. Oh, see how he moved? Yeah, he does not he does not like the light. He's moving away. He's gonna he's gonna put him in the corner. You see how he's his corner there? And he's gonna wait. If it's gonna hunt in the light, he's gonna do it so he does minimal movement. He does not like to move too much. He's like a, he's supposed to be like a, a laying log or something. Somewhat unpredictable. But it doesn't look like too much is going to happen. Even though these two fish are more curious. You see the other fish, they figured it out. <laughs> they know. You see where that fish is right there? That's where the other guy hid for an entire year. He's getting impatient. I don't think he wants to wait. I don't think he wants to wait at all. He's excited. He's excited. I can see his whiskers moving all over the place, trying to find him. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to kill the light. He's going to feel a lot more comfortable. He'll probably move right back to the fighting position. You see him move there? You see? Now. Oh. Maybe he's waiting for this one to come into his corner. He's a patient bugger. This is hard to get on film, let me tell you. You never know. You put the camera down for one second and bam, they're gone. Oh, he's just going to go right for it. He doesn't even care. He doesn't even care. Right to the attack position. Oh, this poor comet. He doesn't even know what's coming for him. The big guy knows. He's probably going to try to herd the fish over here. This guy, he's impatient. You see, when I very first stuck these guys in, he just went right up to them and bullied them. Pushed them right in the corner and just tried to eat them. But he couldn't. So he just ended up smacking them with his mouth enough times that they figured out, stay the F away from him. It's alright, he'll come. He's getting impatient. I know the flicker of his tail, I can see it. He's moving around. That's not like him. He's more like... I'm gonna stay in one corner kind of guy. He's a long fish, let me tell you. I got him like a little guy. Now he's at least two, almost two feet. I'd say anywhere from 20 inches to 24 inches, no problem. He comes unspaced. See, he doesn't even want to wait. He's hungry. He's probably just gonna chase him straight down. These guys are probably coming over to see how his friends are. See if he's good. Three, two, 
One. Oh, and he got him. Look at that, mate. Goodbye. Goodbye, Comet Fish. Goodbye. Well done, mate. Well done. Okay. Oh, he spit him out. I've never seen that. I scared him too much. I went to turn the light on so we could all get a good glimpse of him in his mouth. I've never seen him spit a fish out. Oh, he's freaking out now. He's mad. Yeah, I think I'm scared him with all my yelling. <laughs> it's all right, buddy. You were just on TV. That means we can get twice the coverage of the same fish. That's beautiful. Let me tell you, folks. This fish moves faster than any fish you'll ever see. I wonder if he's going to try to eat him again. Oh, he might. He just had a nice meal in his mouth and he spit him out because I scared him too much. He decided to move too fast. I don't want him going to the top of the edge. It's all electrical things up there. <laughs> He's going to mess it up. And I'm going to have to fucking sit here and fix it. Just to get a good glimpse. I don't know if we caught some of that movement. How fast this guy goes. But we're just going to see if we can just, just give a little... Tap, it's a little tap. Oh no, he doesn't. He doesn't mind me. Usually he does. Was oh, scared, ready? Poof. Oh no, he's not. Now nah, he's in hunting mode again. He's oh, there he is. There he is. Twice the coverage on the same fish. Count it. Ten seconds. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Two, one, hit him! Oh, three, two, one, he's gonna hit him. He's backing up, he's getting his power stroke. He's getting his power stroke. Waiting. Waiting for the right time again. What a waste. Buddy, this is not your corner. Obviously, it's too small. I put. Lots of stuff in there so that other fish can survive, you know? Like trying to hide and stuff. Yeah, I'll turn on the light, you can all see. Look how big this guy is. That's an 18 inch tank, wide tank, I believe. It's much longer than two feet, er, uh, than a foot. It's a, it's a long one, you see, it's a long one. This guy's crazy, crazy. But he's gonna grow six feet long. 250 pounds, he's a river monster. He's a river monster. Monster. And that one just got eaten and spit out like Jonah. Jesus. <laughs> you are lucky because you wouldn't be swimming right now, fella. He would be, but not like you are. He just sideways and stuck in his mouth until you couldn't breathe anymore and then he'd eat you. Well, that's all for today. My arm's getting tired. It's been 8 minutes and 30 seconds of craziness. Absolute craziness.